all of you, our supporters, our friends, the people that believed in this guy who gave me an opportunity at the age of 27 to say, hey, be a part of this process. We need new energy, new vision, and to allow me to co-chair Senator Inouye's campaign where the interest has peaked for this political journey that we've been on. If you hadn't had the faith and the hope to allow me to serve on the Charter Review Commission, to elect me to the Board of Directors of KIC, to put me in office at the County Council, to allow me to serve at the State Legislature in the House of Representatives, and all of you to bring me back home, to allow me to come back home, to be with my family, and still have the faith to allow me to serve this guy, this C plus student, who perhaps bagged your groceries in the grocery store, or rang you up as a cashier in Koloa Big Save, or maybe made a Subway sandwich and asked you, would you like to make this a foot long? <laughs> Where I learned the value of customer service, the importance of taking care of the people that we have to take care of. Or perhaps it was delivering your newspapers or making shave ice for you during the hot summer days in LAL. Or maybe it was watching your kids at Wilcox School working A+, where for two years I was assigned to special needs children, where I learned humility and compassion, and that just because people are different, they shouldn't be treated differently. <laughs> or maybe it was on the soccer field coaching your son, teaching them that having fun, that working together, succeeding together, failing together, picking each other up, that treating people fairly and nice was more important than winning at all costs. Or perhaps it was coaching your daughter on those same soccer fields to teach these women that they are our equals and just as capable, if not more, than their male counterparts and should be treated as such. Well, maybe that's where I've met you. But I can tell you these life lessons I'm very grateful for. And I'm here tonight because people have come up to say that they're looking for leadership. Leadership that looks for a collaboration to instill hope. Hope that can motivate each and every one of us that we are the solution to the many challenges that is not incumbent upon any one person but all of us together. If you believe in collaboration and hope, please join us. We have room for you. You've asked for leadership with experience, private sector experience, a lifetime of private ex sector experience to be groomed by people like Wesley Park, to be groomed by people like my father, to be groomed by all the people from the visitor industry to the agricultural sector, to be in the mix of it all, to understand how challenging it is to keep your doors open. I've heard your pleas for help. Or maybe it's public sector experience. Experience being able to deliver tangible initiatives to make our island safer through policy making, to improve our economy by delivering tangible appropriations to improve our schools, to improve our economy, to improve our infrastructure, to improve Kauai, to improve your backyards. This is the experience that I can bring. If you're looking for that kind of experience, please join us. From the bottom of my heart, on behalf of my mother and father, who I miss dearly, but I feel them all around us, we want to thank you. We want to ask you to please join us. We are going to need your help getting to that journey, getting to that mayor's seat. Together, there is much that we can do. Aloha. God bless. I love you all. Thank you so much for being with us.